what's up you all welcome back to exotic tea blog i'm back with another video but before we get into this one subscribe to my second channel at exotic tea lounge i've been posting a whole lot of exclusive over there you can check the link in the description and also comment section but before that like comment and subscribe make sure you hit the notification bell for more videos so we're about to get into some things today so we're gonna start up with the queen of rap Nicki minaj basically coming out to make history and also break records ciao so Nicki Minaj has officially become the first female rapper in history to reach 31 billion streams on Spotify or credit. So congratulations to Nicki Minaj, the queen of rap has been winning and um none of those girls with a heavy payola they get in the whole um playlisting can still out to Nicki Minaj because Nicki has songs that um are gonna get streamed every other day she's got longevity songs she's got songs that's gonna stay for years and none of those girls can even do that Nicki's got um super bass she's got starship she's got um beauty and the beat she's got she, she's got over um 30 on 30 on forgettable songs but your fave can't even have that that's why she's the queen of rap and her streams is always gonna keep adding so congratulations to the queen of rap i'm really here for that moving on from there Nicki minaj also um got food for the barbs she told them they should go to um any restaurant or food stand and they should tell them that a bill is on Nicki minaj only um original barbs not the body young coming to eat from Nicki minaj Nicki minaj is actually doing um generosity work that's why i love the queen of rap she's always going to do that for the fans because she love her fans and the fans are always gonna be supporting the queen of rap that's the reason she's the queen but let me know if you feel about this nikki generosity in the comment section below Marvin over to cardi b aka the river cricket aka Barciana. so um allegedly cardi b now has a collaboration in the stash with anita and shakira so y'all remember when i said cardi b wanted to change her brand of music she said she want to leave the rap genre maybe she wanna um do um she wanna go to a Latin bag I, and I kind of think if she does Latin songs not like it's gonna be that big but I think she's gonna sell over there because um she tried um getting Bad Bunny on the bongos but he didn't um give her that collaboration so sad so now she has a collaboration with Anita and also Shakira so I want y'all to let me know in the comment section if you're here for this transformer doing a collaboration with Anita and Shakira we all know her and Anita has a collaboration before and that song didn't do much but um she want to do one with Shakira let me know if you'll be here for that and also a Cardi B fan base came out here shading Nicki Minaj last time I saw you departing from the Billboard Hop 100 saying oh Nicki Minaj you go fetch a nice spice but at this point y'all being the most delusional fan base ever like I said y'all being delusional let Nicki Minaj be because Cardi B is flopping with bongos which got over 17 to 18 million radio two million dollar for its video and also got the whole playlisting and also every other thing if last time i saw you got like the whole push cardi b bongos got definitely that song is gonna be charting because the bobs are gonna be buying but y'all being delusional so y'all should sit the fuck let me know if you about this topic in the comment section below marvin over to Lado, aka scratch of so my t has been confirmed because i was the first person to tell y'all that Lado was gonna be doing a male rap collaboration and here goes Lado announcing a new single it's a party featuring baby drill it's coming out this friday so i want you guys to let me know if you feel about this in the comment section to me the song is giving put it on the floor again and also the art cover is giving me so witty birthday that flopped but anyways y'all should let me know in the comment section if you believe lado can manage and also struggle to get to the top because right now i don't think um she went um top 50 or i don't think she debuted with um put it on the floor originally i think it was a cardi b remix that got her to the billboard and i want you guys to let me know in the comment section if you think lado can always or she can now struggle to get a top 80 to top 90 debut or also a bumbling on the billboard hop 100 with a song because she's now coming out to hype the song and anytime she does stuff like this she's guaranteed the payola so i want you all to let me know in the comment section and currently rc is winning for the payola game in rap because cardi not getting that payola for atlantic but doja is getting it let me know in the comment section if you're here for this collaboration anyways moving over to my girl sexy red so actually sexy red is out here out selling and also selling her tour so um congratulations to sexy red i'm actually liking this for her i think she's doing a great job right now because her tour is actually selling and when she's singing and also performing you can hear people chant the lyrics some grammy winners can't even go on tour 
tour so congratulations to sexy red i'm not shitting nobody but some of your faves can't go on tour on their own they can't they can't even sell so this is a very good look for sexy red i'm loving the people who are coming out here to like and support her i think it's a very good look for her career and also i'm here for sexy red shaky dreads i want you guys to let me know if you feel about this song because i'm actually feeling the song right now let me know your thoughts and your opinion about all the topics i discussed in this video let me know in the comment section like comment and subscribe and also subscribe to my second channel at exotic tea lounge link in comment section and also description and as usual thanks for watching